Hey everybody, welcome to the Soap Thing Project. If you've been here before, welcome back. And as you can see by the tree behind me, Christmas is fast approaching. It is December 15th at the time this video is being released. So I wanna wish every viewer and subscriber a very Merry Christmas. So in this video, we're gonna do a comprehensive review of the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Traditional Wet Shaving Starter Kit. Coming up next. All right, you can pick this up at phoenixartisanaccoutrements.com for 45 US dollars. Let's take a look at the presentation. It has a very nice uh, protective sleeve over the box that comes right off. As you can see, I'll set that over here. The box is orange and it's got a really nice uh, reflective silver logo on it, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. Let's open the box really quickly. Actually, before we do, let me just take a moment to show you exactly how this is laid out. It has a magnetic flap, it opens like that. And it's really heavy duty um, paperboard, fiberboard. It's packaged uh, the same way a lot of electronic devices are. So some pretty, pretty high quality packaging on this. So let's open it up. Now when you open up the box, the first thing you're gonna notice is a set of instructions. I'm not gonna read these on the video today. If you are somebody who is new to wet shaving, I'm gonna refer you to a couple of how-to videos that are in the description of the video. So if you need to learn how to wet shave, uh, check out the description and uh, click on those videos. You'll, you'll get hooked up, definitely. So let's open it up. And here is the contents of the kit. As you can see, we have a brush, shaving soap, razor, aftershave, and a couple packets of blades. The inside of this box is actually really dense foam, and the retention on this is no joke. I mean, this stuff's not going to... <laughs> Yeah, that happened. What a moron. Okay, so maybe the retention on some of these is better than others, but here's the kit. You see all the contents in it. So we're gonna go over all the items one by one, and we're gonna talk about them, so let's get started. Now the brush I'm actually not going to take out of the box because I actually already have one that I own. It's a synthetic brush. It's kind of a uh, imitation horsehair looking knot. This is the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Green Ray. Synthetic shave brush. It's not the most dense synthetic knot I've ever seen and it doesn't have a ton of backbone, but it'll splay for you and generate a lather without a lot of trouble. I've never had any issues uh, generating a lather with this brush. So good synthetic brush in the box. Next, let's talk about the soap. Now you can get these soap in the aftershave in five or six different combinations. There's this one, there's a Bay Rum, there's a few other ones. This one just happens to be Future Fiction, which is a zingy kind of citrus and ginger sort of scent. It's really nice, really a, a crowd pleaser, I think. So in this tub, you get two ounces of shaving soap with more than enough room to do a tub lather, if you're into that sort of thing. Personally, I am a bowl latherer, so I will just tend to grab a cosmetic spoon, stick it in there, scoop a little bit out, put it at the bottom of a bowl, and lather it that way. But there's lots of different ways to lather a shaving soap, so if you're new to wet shaving, make sure you uh, watch a couple YouTube videos on how to make a lather. I just noticed that this is CK6. I figured they would have just loaded you up with CK1 and called it a day, but no, they, they pulled out all their stops for this one, so this soap is a really high quality soap. It's easy to lather, it's got a lot of structure, it's got good fuel efficiency, metaphorically speaking, a little bit goes a long way with this stuff, so CK6 is no joke. Here is the two ounce starter kit soap, side by side with a full size Phoenix Shaving CK6. So that'll be the soap that comes in the kit, is the two ounce. Here we have the one ounce aftershave bottle that comes in the starter kit. Alcohol, hydrosol, aloe vera, glycerin are some of the ingredients in this uh, aftershave bottle, so high quality stuff. And here it is side by side with a full size PAA aftershave splash cologne. So there you have the aftershave. Next up in the kit is the razor, which is 
a chrome plated zinc head with a chrome plated brass handle. It does look an awful lot like an Edwin Jagger or Mula style head. Douglas Smythe of Phoenix Shaving says that it's not inspired by that, but I have my suspicions. It does look like a fairly high quality razor though, considering what you're paying for it. It does have uh, quite a long stem on the head, at least I think so, compared to most razors. And this will probably give you quite a mild shave. The Merker, Mula, Edwin Jagger uh, razor heads often do. It's a mild and forgiving shave for those who are new to the uh, wet shaving hobby or just getting into this. So that'll be the razor for the PAA wet shaving kit. And then finally the blades. It's advertised you can get just over three months worth of shaves out of these. So we have some sharks, five pack of shark blades, and then another five pack of Voskhod blades. So each of these packs has five double-edged blades in it. I could see people getting four, five, six shaves out of these. I'll tend to throw them away after the third shave just because a lot of times blades are hit or miss. Some of them last a long time, some of them don't, but I have never found a blade that wouldn't last at least three shaves. So I'm usually three shaves and done, but I could see where you could get three months out of these two packs. So those are the blades for the Phoenix Shaving Starter Kit. So if you're interested in trying wet shaving, this definitely covers all the basics. You get everything you need and nothing that you don't. It's pretty straightforward. Let's talk about price. So this, like I said at the beginning of the video, is 45 US dollars. And I think at that price, you're pretty much getting your money's worth. I would not call this a bargain or a steal. I think this is an adequate price for the hardware and software that you get. I think what makes this particularly compelling is the fact that you get everything in one spot. You get a razor, you get a brush, you get a shaving soap and an aftershave and you get blades. So you don't have to hunt all those things down individually. So I think that's really what sells this. You can just pick it up and you get it all at once and you really don't have to think about it. Now, if I were making my own wet shaving starter kit, there's a few things I would do differently. I'd probably choose a different razor and a different brush, but this is nonetheless a very, very good way to get into wet shaving. If you're curious about it and you've never tried it before and you're not trying to spend a ton of money, this is definitely a competitively priced way to do that. So go ahead and check this out on phoenixartisanaccoutrements.com if you think this is something you'll be interested in. I want to thank everybody for watching. That'll be the review for today. Until next time, this is Soap Thing telling you, shave like you mean it. Thanks for watching.